In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to fix anti-aliasing in Minecraft. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. If you believe that distant objects appear jagged and you don't like the corners or how everything looks, a possible solution could be anti-aliasing. So in this video, I'm gonna show you how to properly use anti-aliasing and make sure that you are getting the best performance possible. So all that you have to do for both Bedrock and Java Edition is to pause the game, go over to the settings and find the video or graphical settings. When you scroll down in here on Bedrock Edition, you will be able to find anti-aliasing as the last option. If you are doing this process on Java, it is going to be somewhere else, but you simply have to look for anti-aliasing. On Bedrock, you will be able to choose between 1, 2, 4, 8 and finally 16. Of course, 16 is going to be much more demanding, but you are going to get the best anti-aliasing results possible. Like I said, usually this is going to be reflected in the way that far objects, especially the corners, are going to be rendered. If anti-aliasing is set to low, maybe to 1 or 2, the corners are going to be really jagged. But the more anti-aliasing you have, the more smoothed out they're going to be. Of course, you can pick a comfortable medium. Maybe if you don't notice a lot of difference between 8 and 16, it's better to leave it at 8, so at least you get the bonus performance. But regardless of which option you pick, it is going to reflect immediately as soon as you leave the menu, and you should be able to perceive the differences. I recommend that you actually go into your own world and you look at it through your own monitor or TV. Zoom in if necessary and take pictures to compare. But as long as you set the anti-aliasing on the game's video settings, you will be good to go. Besides this, you can change many more options. And on Java, there are going to be a lot of things that also refer to performance. So I recommend taking a look at those as well. I hope I was able to help you on how to fix anti-aliasing in Minecraft. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.